Right, we're ready to define the derivative of f at a number a, and we use this notation f prime of a to be the derivative of f at a. All right, so all this discussion we've had about instantaneous rate of change, which if you recall, the instant instantaneous rate of change of a function f is equal to the limit as x goes to a, f of x minus f of a, all over x minus a, or equivalently can be written as the limit as h goes to zero of f of a plus h minus f of a, all over h. Those are both the instantaneous rate of change of my function f at a. And since this is such an important concept, we give this particular limit a name. And that name is the derivative. So this limit, also written as this, is the expression for f prime of a. So let's look at an example, which is more of what we've already done. But if we have, let's say, f of x equals 2x squared minus 4, and we would like to find f prime of 2, this means we are looking for the limit as x approaches 2 of f of x minus f of 2 all over x minus 2. That's what this means. f prime of 2 is equal to this limit, which is our derivative of f at 2. All right, let's go ahead and practice it since we can never get too much practice taking limits. So the limit as x approaches 2. So my function at x is just 2x squared minus 4 minus, now let's evaluate this function at 2. So it's 2 times 4, which is 8. 8 minus 4 is 4 all over x minus 2. This is equal to the limit as x goes to 2 of 2x squared minus 8 over x minus 2. If I were to try direct substitution, I would get 0 over 0, which tells me do more work. I'm going to try factoring out a 2 and then factoring the difference of two squares. See if you believe this. This limit is actually equal to the limit as x goes to 2 of 2 times x minus 2, x plus 2, all over x minus 2. Now I can cancel, and I can do direct substitution. 2 times 2 plus 2 is 8. So the derivative of my function at 2 is 8. Now what does that represent geometrically? You remember? Well, the derivative at 2 is the slope of the tangent line to my function at 2. It's the slope of my tangent line. 2f at x equals 2. That's what it is geometrically. What does it mean in terms of our function? Well, it is the instantaneous rate of change of my function at 2.